Hi, Sarah here from Cycle Maintenance Academy. In this video, I will show you how to spot the difference between cable and hydraulic disc brakes. Before we start, subscribe to our YouTube channel. OK, let's begin. Why does a bike have disc brakes? Disc brakes offer more braking power. This is noticeable, especially in wet weather where disc brakes provide more consistent and responsive stopping power over rim brakes. The pads last longer. A rim brake pad is made of rubber. A disc brake pad is made out of metal, which is a tougher material. The rims don't wear out. Because the braking surface is on the rotor located on the hub, the rims aren't constantly being worn away as they are with rim brakes. There are two common types of disc brake and they look very similar. But is your disc brake hydraulic or cable? Is there a cable sticking out at the end? If there is, then it is a cable disc brake. You'll be able to see the cable moving and operating the caliper by squeezing the lever. Hydraulic disc brakes don't have a cable. They operate by compressing fluid. If you squeeze the hydraulic brake lever, you will only be able to see the pads moving, not the caliper. Does your brake lever have a barrel adjuster? On a cable disc brake lever, where the outer cable joins, there is one. This can be used to adjust the brake. There is a lesson on how to do this in our Cycle Maintenance Basics course. Hydraulic disc brake levers don't have a barrel adjuster. Where the hose joins the brake lever, there is a plastic cover. And underneath this is a screw with a hexagonal top. Tightened into the reservoir. Don't adjust this screw, even if your brake feels loose. You might damage the lever and loose fluid. Thanks for watching and check out our other videos. We have also created some online courses. I've attached the link below this video.